Yep, I'm going live. Hello, hello. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's start this over. Hello, 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 and welcome to the Nate McMillan Revenge Game. Tonight, we've got the Indiana Pacers versus the Seattle Supersonics. Rest in peace. Hashtag not my thunder. Uh, guys, I'm so excited tonight. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Uh, I'm going to be drinking a Guinness. Uh, Guinness Draft Stout. Uh, one little nitrogen ball inside. Uh, as I try to not get my butt kicked by our namesake, Mr. Detlef Shrimp. Um, for those of you who don't know, Detlef, uh, originally a Seattle Supersonic before he was an Indiana Pacer. Uh, and without any further ado, folks, let's get into it. So I'm just going to go over here. I'm going to unpause this emulation. Yep. And we're going to see how this goes. I don't know how I'm feeling about this. All right, all right, all right. I got Reggie tipping off. Got Sean Kemp and Gary Payton. This this Sonics team is actually legit really good. I like, you got Detlef Shrimp coming off the bench for them. All right, we got Reggie over here. Nope, pass the ball. All right. See, the thing is, Rick is more reliable in this game than I think people give him credit. Shove! 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 Uh, see, I can't rebound to save my life. That's that's my biggest liability, I think, in this game, is I just cannot rebound. Boom shakalaka! All right, all right. Shove him, Reggie, shove him! All right. Gotta think that wasn't what we were going for there. Yeah, no, so... Uh, Unfortunately, Nate McMillan is actually not in this game. It is Sean Kemp, Gary Payton, uh, and Detlef Shrimp. Oh, get over there. No! Hey! Uh, actually, one of the things that really surprised me, I was doing some research on this uh, this old Sonics team before this stream just to see what, uh, see what they were like. I was really surprised to see how well-rounded they were. So all three of these guys uh, were pretty even in scoring totals. Uh, uh, Sean Kemp averaged 18.7 a game. Gary Payton uh, averaged 20.6. And Detlef Shrimp, uh, he averaged 19.2 per game. So they were like, what? They were pretty well-rounded. Uh, which doesn't surprise me. I mean, like, this is actually a pretty deep team. Uh, I'd feel bad if I were a Sonics fan, because I feel like... Uh, 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 for two. See, that's a that's a Nate McMillan shot right there. That's a real Nate McMillan shot. Just one step in from the three-point line. Really long two, really inefficient. No reason to take it. Um, but yeah, and this... They were also... This was the Sonics team that was coached by George Carl. Uh, so, of... More notably, more notably of uh, Utah Jazz fame. I don't know who's coaching the Jazz in this, because I know they have Malone and Stockton still. If that shot went in, I was going to jump off a building. That would make me so mad. All right. Down six. Let's see what I... Uh, Let's see what we got here. I have no injury problems, which is really, really good. That's, I feel like that's my biggest issue in this game. I'm usually getting shoved over and I still don't know how to shove myself. So because of that, I'm always dealing with injury problems. I don't have to deal with that this time, but I'm running, I'm running Rick Smith's as that point center. Cause I think, I think Rick, he's uh, he's gonna be my boy tonight. All right, let's get back there and play some defense. I'm, I'm so bad at defense, I just sometimes play this little 1-1 zone. Oh my god! If I knew how to get rebounds, this game would be over. I'd be so good at this game if I could just get some rebounds. Ricks, what? Okay, fine. The layup in Dutchman. I remember when I was a kid and I used to watch SpongeBob, the Flying Dutchman made me think of Rick Smith so much. I thought they got that from Rick Smith because I was a very egocentric 10-year-old. Um, I... 
I definitely thought that like everything was inspired by the Indiana Pacers because that's kind of how I lived my life. Re why? How was that rejected? No! You're telling me Sean Kemp is rejecting that shot? Are you kidding me? Sean Kemp is rejecting that shot? Ah. Okay. All right, folks, we're gonna need Reggie to get involved here soon, so. Let's penetrate and then let's kick. No, oh, no, let's kick. Kick, kick, kick Adelphia. All right. Rick, so here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna go down here and then you're gonna pat. Oh. I keep forgetting which is the pass button. I'm very bad at this game. I hope, I hope you're starting to notice the trend here, which is uh, the main theme of this stream is I am bad at this game. I hope that uh, before I have completed this season, I have like figured out how to passably play this game. Oh my goodness. If I get, if I got half the second chances that I end up giving up to the CPU in this game, I swear. Okay. All right, Richard. And now, shove, 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 shove. Yeah. Pass. There we go. All right, all right, folks. All right. Heating up, heating up. Shove, shove. Yes. Boom. All right. Oh, that was a two. That's BS. That is crapola. All right, all right. We're narrowing the gap. We're narrowing the gap. We're gonna be okay. I believe in us, folks. I believe in us. Do you believe in us? I believe in us. Um, I'll tell you what, if you want to, you can drop in chat anything you think I should be doing with the lineups. I think I need to get Reggie out of here because I cannot have him in trouble for, in foul trouble for the end of the game. So I'm gonna go Smith's McKee. We got Sean Kemp and Gary Payton. Have we seen Detlef Shrimp yet? I wasn't really paying attention that last, uh, that last quarter. Oh my goodness. All right. Derek, your main job is to play defense, buddy. I love you, but I'm gonna need your help here because I'm bad at defense and you are very good at defense. Unless, of course, regarding Larry John. Or no, that was Antonio Davis. I was about to make a reference to the, the phantom four-point play. That was that was definitely Antonio Davis, not Derek and Keith. Get there. All right. All right. Yep. What? No! Are you kidding? Are you, are, you, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Shove. Shove him. Shove him. Shove him. Shove him. How is Derek McKee getting dunked on by Gary Payton? There's no way. There's no way. There we go. That's that's what a Dutchman looks like when he dunks. That's... All right. Shove. 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 Shove button. Shove button. Shove button. Shove him. Shove him. Get there. All right, there you go. I'm just gonna let Red CPU assist do your thing. What? No! Oh my God. Oh, cheese and rice. Cheese and rice. All right, let's get to the baseline. Let's dunk it. Let's not let them reject our dunks. Right, let's shove them over. Shove them, shove them. There we go. Okay, heating up, heating up. We're down three, we're heating up. If we can just keep this close before Reggie gets back in the game, we're gonna be in good shape, folks. I, I, all right, all right. Let's just match that two. Let's get the ball back. Let's go two for one here. Boom, shaka laka. That's a good dunk. Uh, the other thing I found surprising is I was researching this Sonics team. All right, see, I got, I got plugged. Oh no, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. <sighs> okay, that's okay. We're fine, guys, we're fine. We're fine, we're down five. We have Reggie coming back in, we're gonna be okay. Um, so this is actually advice. Can I screenshot this and send this directly to Nate McMillan? I think, uh, I didn't realize that you can decrease the probability that an opponent is gonna make the shot by standing closer to them. I feel like I shouldn't rag on Nate for that. I should be ragging on like Jim O'Brien for that. Um, Jim O'Brien, I was watching a game over the weekend um, where Jim O'Brien was coaching the Celtics. Uh, I think it was the 2003 playoffs, 2003 or maybe 2004 playoffs. It was 2003 playoffs. 2003 playoffs, 
Um, and we had Isaiah Thomas coaching the Pacers versus Jim O'Brien coaching the Celtics. And it was one of the worst coach games of basketball I've ever seen in the NBA playoffs. I can't believe they let that fly. Uh, early 2000s basketball was a wild place. I gotta say. Oh, steal it! I just, the way... Okay, I... There it is, Reggie. There it is. Now just go back and shove people. Shove. Shove. That's how you play like those 2003 Indiana play Indiana Pacers. What's funny is like this is really 90s. This is really... 90s NBA looked a lot like this. Just a lot of shoving. Although, surprisingly... Much accurate, much more accurate uh, field goal shooting, I feel like. 90s, uh, 90s field goal shooters, not very accurate. Oh, wide open shot. Boom, baby. All right, folks, we are right back in this. It's Miller time. Oh, no, 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 Richard! Richard Smith. What are you doing, bud? What are you doing? See, that's the problem when the jump button is the same as the shoot button, is you jump on defense and then you get the ball because you jump to get the ball. I don't know if you know that, but that's the whole, the whole point of this game is to get the ball. And then you shoot the ball when you get the ball. And that's no good. Ah. All right, we're gonna have to get stopped though, because this is a four point game and there's not enough time left. Goaltending. All right, folks, we got this. We got this. Just need to stop here. Just need to stop. Shove him. Shove him. Shove him. Get that board. Yes! Richard! No, Rick! Rick! Maybe I should stop calling him Richard since that's not his name. All right, Reggie, it's Miller time. Oh, no! We got to get that ball back. Well, folks, Seattle wins. All right, what do you think? Should we go one more? Should we go one more round? I don't know who we're gonna play. I wanna show you guys, I wanna show you folks why uh, I hate the way that Sega has set this game up. So you might be wondering, Tim, why'd you decide to play the Supersonics tonight? There is no reason. I'm gonna show you what the experience looks like. Game over. Yes, it is. I'm gonna show you the experience that I have to deal with every single time um, every single time I want to play a game. So I'll play a team game, right? I go to team game. I'm not going to keep my initials. And I get to pick my team, right? So I'll pick my team. I'm going to go over to Indiana. We're going to toggle over to Indiana. Uh, how do you select your opponent, Tim? You don't. You don't get to set your opponent. I just select Indiana, and it pairs me up against whoever the hell they want. And that's really frustrating to me because I want to play. All right, so we're going to play the Hornets now. All right, great. Let's... All right, let's shove some Hornets. Oh, we got Alonzo Mourning. All right, we got Alonzo Mourning and some John. I don't Oh, what? I thought I had the steal there. Also, what are these uh, Pacer unis? I feel like we got these, like, at least these Hornet uniforms look like something the Hornets have worn at some point. These, like, white with blue. I don't know when we ever wore anything that looked like this. Um, like, does this look recognizable to, this looks, actually the closest thing I've seen to this is like our current City Edition jerseys. That is the closest thing I've seen to anything like this. Ah! No, Rick, grab the ball. At some point I have to stop blaming Rick because it's not his fault, it's my fault, right? It's like, oh no, 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 no. See, I'm the one who told Rick to pass it to the guy who just fell over. And now we're down eight to nothing. And we gotta find our way out of this hole. So let's, that's not how you wanna do it. Uh-oh, folks, this is, I don't like how this feels at all. We gotta double, now, uh, what? The, the unfortunate thing is I can't call a timeout. Actually, maybe this, maybe this is what, I'm starting to understand where Nate McMillan picked up a lot of his coaching habits. And I feel like he played a lot of NBA Jam. Because in this game, uh, you can't call timeouts. 
You accidentally shoot a lot of long twos because you think they're three pointers. Um, oh my God. Apparently your post players have no clue uh, how to grab rebounds. Uh, another staple of the Nate McMillan uh, of Nate McMillan offense and defense. Now, some of you might be saying, but Tim, doesn't DeMontis Sabonis take a lot of rebounds? Uh, yeah, but that doesn't count because most of his rebounds are rebounding his own misses, so I don't count those. But uh, apparently, and there's the there's the Rick Smith's uh, stretch five three-pointer that he was so well known for. This game doesn't make any gosh darn sense. It's a foul! It's a foul, ref! Yeah, call that. All right, I'm not liking this at all. All right, to avoid having your dunk blocked, I need to learn about pass off to your open teammate. Okay, see, this is these are the types of tips that I need to be hearing right now. So thank you for that. Uh, we got Alonzo. Oh, we got a Muggsy Bogues is coming in the game, and Reggie is looking super injured. But I'm gonna keep running with him. I'm gonna run my. We're gonna run that point center again. Let's see how that goes. All right, folks. All right. Whoop. Shove, 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 shove. I'm just really good at getting in the way to get dunked on. I'm really good at creating posters for the other team. Should I, uh, should I pass that off? Is that what you're telling me? Ah, there we go. Ah, I did not mean to do that. Banks open today. Not for long though. Because there's a there's a coronavirus epidemic. No good. Okay. All right. Is there any chance we're gonna dig ourselves out of this hole? No oh my god! I think see I think what it's telling me is I should have passed that off. And see that was another long two. Classic Nate McMillan offense going on here. So good at shoving. You're so much better at shoving than I am. Yeah, shove, shove, shove. Oh my indeed. See, they're good at they're so good at blocking dunks. I don't know how I don't know how they do it. Because when I try to block a dunk, they're on fire. I don't I don't understand that. See, I, that's what happens. When I try to block a dunk, when they block a dunk, oh! They're, all right, well, Rick is Rick is heating up. I feel like Rick is not getting the credit he deserves right now. Oh my goodness! Muggsy Bogues. Muggsy Wugsy Bogues. Did Muggsy Bogues just block Rick's mixed shot? Are you kidding me? No, no, this game makes no sense. Boom shakalaka indeed. And Reggie Miller's Duncan. I feel like they did not pay any attention at all to the actual players when they designed this game. Um, also, Rick Smith and Reggie Miller look about the same height. Uh, there we go, there we go. You gotta shoot that. Ah! Okay, all right, eight point game at half. We can pull this out. We can pull this out, right? Reggie's super injured. Uh, things aren't looking great for Rick. So let's get Derek McKee in there. I mean, save Reggie for the fourth quarter. We're gonna have ourselves a good third quarter. No turn quarters today. All right, no turn quarter. Say it with me. Up. Oh, all right, great start. Goal tuned. Counts the same. I'm starting to get, I'm starting to master the shove button. I'm not very good at shoving when I'm near people, but I'm good at shoving now. It's a big step up. Get that rig. Oh yeah. Up. Oh, okay. I need to quit jumping when I need when I need to shove. Uh. There we go. All right. And shove, 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 shove. Get over there. Get back, Rick. Get back. You got to shove. You got more shoving to do. Go into the basketball court where we can 
and shove our friends down now and go into the basketball court. We're gonna shove our friends all down now. Gonna shove our friends down on the basketball court now. Shoving down our friends who play in Charlotte. Okay. At least Rick is putting up some points. That's a that's an encouraging sign. There you go. Stay on, Derek. 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 Whoop. Pass it. There we go. Ah. See, Rick Smith is just doing unicorn things over here. I think no one's given Rick Smith the respect he deserves. He was the original Giannis. That's I've been saying that for years since before Giannis was a thing. I've been saying Rick Smith. He's the original Giannis, and people said. Tim, what's a Giannis? I said, nothing. What's a Giannis with you? Shove. Oh, no, he just shoved Derek McKee over. How do you do that? Ah! Hey! Hey! I don't like this game. This game is really dumb. I think this game is dumb, and anyone who likes it is dumb. I don't... All right. No, up. Oh, shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. No, don't shoot, though. Okay. All right. Okay, still an eight-point game. Right? All right, here's, here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna put Reggie in, and things are gonna be okay. I feel like this is, uh, for those of you who didn't have the joy of watching the Indiana Pacers uh, as children, uh, this is what it was like. It was just, uh, it, was, it was very bad basketball most of the game, and then Reggie came in, and you just kind of assumed that we'd figure it out. Uh, that was most of what it was like having Reggie Miller on your team. Uh, now, I don't know if that's going to translate to NBA Jam, because the thing I've learned about this game that I don't think I knew before I took this challenge on is, uh, unlike the NBA Jams of my youth, uh, the NBA's Jam, if you will, uh, the, the game I was used to playing, uh, was actually released in 1998. It's like, you know those box-style arcade games? A lot of those were produced in 1998, and the roster the Pacers had in that game was Reggie Miller, Chris Mullen, and I don't, and, I, and probably Rick Smith. I think it was Rick Smith, Reggie Miller, and Chris Mullen. And I would play as Reggie Miller and Chris Mullen, and they're the best three-point shooting duo in the entire game, and I would just run train on folks. Um, that was a two, another another one of those Nate McMillan twos. That's not what you're going for. All right, we're just gonna stay down. We're just gonna stay down. No jumping, no jumping, no jumping, no jumping, no jumping. All right, now jump. Yeah, all right! Boom shakalaka, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go again. Burrows, what's my weakness, man? Okay, then. Whoop, whoop, pass it. Yeah, boom, baby. It's a two-point basketball game. Slick would be proud of us. That's a basketball game. All right. Okay. All right, all right. Four-point game, 30 seconds left. And it's... It's Miller time! Boom, baby! Boom, boom, boom! All right, let's just let him score. That's fine. All right, let's go. Another game, another chance to tie it with a last second. Three, one, no! This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. This is what the 90s, what was 90s NBA was actually like. I feel like... Uh, Reggie put up 40 though. Reggie hung 40 on these folks. So, listen, uh, 40 points, 10 dunks for Reginald Wayne Miller. That's a, that's a good game in anybody's book, I think. So, uh, meanwhile, Muggsy Bogues with four dunks. I'm not buying that. So, he, he was injured 10 times. So, at least I was able to shove him over. Um, I think the real moral of the story is I'm going to continue losing at this game until I learn, uh how to shove and how to rebound. I don't know how to do those things yet. So I think that's gonna be a wrap on my game tonight. Uh, tomorrow I'm gonna be back, we're gonna play some more NBA Jam. Right now I'm 0-3. Uh, at this point in the Pacers season, they were 2-1 in 94-95. So I have a lot of ground to make up. 
Uh, if I'm gonna match their record of, uh, what was it, 50 and 32, I can only lose 29 more times, which means uh, at this rate, we might only have 29 more streams together uh, before I have to shut this thing down. But uh, thank you all for joining me uh, tonight. I am Shrimp Scampy, and uh, it's been an absolute pleasure playing NBA Jam with you. And uh, I think in order to play us out, I'm gonna pull up our trusty theme music. Ladies and gentlemen, have a great evening. It's been a blast. My name is Shrimp Scampy.